Today we'll review a TFCC joint kinesio taping technique. The first step is to determine the cause of the pain. If coming from a TFCC injury, there will be pain with weight bearing and the pain will be relieved with a wrist widget or a similar taping technique. With ECU, there will be no pain with weight bearing, no relief or aching with use of a wrist widget, and pain with palpation at the insertion of the ECU at the base of the fifth metacarpal. This is a wrist widget which can be purchased on Amazon for approximately $29. Here's a review of the kinesio taping technique for a TFCC injury. First, you will want to cut a U-shaped pattern in your tape to create two tails which will wrap around the wrist. Once your edges are rounded and the skin is prepped, you will position your patient for application. The U-shaped opening in the tape will allow the ulnar styloid to come through. The tails will wrap around the wrist. Tear each tail and apply the anchor piece with no tension first. Remove the tape from each tail almost all the way, about an inch from the end. Then apply 30% tension as you wrap around the wrist and finishing with no tension at the end of each tail. This taping application provides a support to a painful wrist when healing from a TFCC tear. It does not limit motion, but it promotes faster healing by reducing pain and improving weight-bearing abilities. ECU tendonitis or subluxation would be at the base of the fifth metacarpal where the tendon inserts. Here is a video of what ECU subluxation can look like upon examination. Stay tuned for our next taping technique on ECU subluxation.